can make a cake. And I'm excited. I'm excited too. Yeah. Okay guys, today it's gonna be good. We're making a uh, cake in my Instant Pot. I just got this Instant Pot for Christmas and I am experimenting with it. I haven't made a lot of successful things in it yet besides like rice and rice. <laughs> so yeah, we're trying out chocolate lava cake. We're make, gonna make them in these little individual dishes. I looked it up and online it says anything you, that is oven safe is Instant Pot safe. Yeah. So I guess we'll find out. These are seven ounces. They're gonna be cute little individual servings. Piper, are you excited? Yeah. Yeah? I am. Um, what are we making a cake for? So I... Uh, Is it for someone's birthday? No. Well, what's it for then? It's uh, uh, for us. Yes, we're making a cake just for us to eat. That's well, the best kind of cake. Um, maybe when Porter gets back, we can make the cakes for Porter too. That is such a nice idea. Let's yeah. make some for Porter too. Maybe Baby Bo would like some too. Let's do this. Yeah. Anyways, how about I can do You can do the eggs and I can do that and that and that and that and that and that. And that. All right, so what I've learned, the little that I've learned about Instant Pots is that you have to have water in it for anything to happen. So this calls for one cup of water. And then it says to place the trivet inside. I'm guessing that that's this thing. Guys, I'm not very experienced in this. Yes, so this could be a total fail. If so, it's gonna be a magnificent fail. Okay, yeah. two eggs. Let's do this. Let's do this. We need two. Get, can we do sugar? sugar? Can we do sugar? Yep. Mm -hmm. Jump it in. Whee. Oh gosh. Oh, come on. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Oh my god, I got it on the ground. It's okay, that's why I'm wearing shoes. Flour and then one tablespoon of cocoa. A pinch of salt. A teaspoon of baking powder. We need some orange zest. Hey Siri, what's orange zest? Naming that tune. No. Okay, here's what's going into my Instant Pot. Three cute little dishes. Uh, I wanna do that. Uh, you wanna, wanna put it in? Yeah, I wanna put it in. Mm, I don't know about that. Okay, so we've got a cup of water in here and we have our little thingy bobber right here. Um, and then, yeah, we're just gonna stick them on in here. Then we'll eat them. Then we'll eat them. Yeah. I'm gonna do these for 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Because they had smaller ones and did it for um, nine minutes in, so I'm just gonna add a minute. <laughs> okay, and then you make sure that it's not on release, but it's unsealed. And then, okay, pressure cook. Okay, we're gonna do 10 minutes. What do you think, Bo? <laughs> do you see yourself? <laughs> okay, so I just missed it, but before it's up to pressure, this little part right here is down, and it'll kind of like jiggle, jiggle, jiggle with steam coming out, and then it'll pop up, so you know that it is like sealed. There shouldn't be steam coming from anywhere on your Instant Pot. Okay, I sound like I know anything, but I really don't. All I know is that the other day I was making something in my Instant Pot, and there was steam coming out the sides of it, and I was like, I don't think that's what it's supposed to be doing. And so I talked to my aunt, who is an expert. Okay, now it's cooking. That only took like five minutes for it to get up to pressure, so that's good. So there's like a little seal on the top of the lid that sometimes if that is not uh, properly fixed in there, then it will um, kind of release steam at the side. So watch out for that. That will not be effective pressure cooking. But yeah, okay, 10 minutes to go. Is it, 
Piper. This is the moment. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. I gotta release the pressure first, Piper. Are you ready? Yeah. Releasing the pressure scares me like every time. It's just a scary thing. Yay! That means we're good to open it! Yay! Should we open it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah! sugar on it, I'm gonna make it even prettier and yummier. Okay, so you guys can see it's totally baked through. It looks great. We did 10 minutes with this one and I think that was the winner. Mm. But it was good. I'm gonna eat this. Okay guys, this recipe is Piper approved and that means it's good. <laughs> so I'll, I'll definitely link the recipe below. Use this in your Instant Pot. Amaze your grandmothers and mothers and friends with this cute little uh, lava cake and I actually think I think this would be a really cute like gift for a friend I wonder they probably have like disposable ones like little bowls in this size right so that might be cute and yeah pretty easy the instant pot if you have one it's always easy to clean it's just like a one pot deal this is fun this is a good one I'm really excited about this okay Piper what do you think good so good and it's that's one mine and this one's yours oh okay well, yeah we have to have our own because they're that good everybody um let me know if you tried out my recipe and if you liked it. And also, please let me know if you have any other good recipes because we need some, yeah, we need some more Instant Pot recipes because it's a lot of fun. We're excited. Yeah. Goodbye. Yep. Okay, bye.